Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Let's Play Brigandine Legend of Forcena. I am your host, Vakos Lenari. Let's get started on episode 13. We have another battle coming up here, the Battle of Cadbury. Immediately following the Battle of Humber, where we took out Norgard, which was an excellent victory on our part, and hopefully we will have the same success here. So, I think we will. The numbers are stacked in our favor just a little bit. So, over here we have our opponents, Shiraha the Ninja, Salial the Bishop, and Paradol the Bishop. So they've got some healing power over here, and quite a bit of powerful monsters on Salial's part especially. He has a lot of room power, in fact I'm going to check on that. 311, right, at level 11. He is an insane knight. He's very formidable, um, so hopefully we won't have too much trouble against him. Anywho, let's go ahead and get this started. The way my formation is right here, it's going to be very tight. Uh, we can make use of the water with our flyers and the hydra, but I want to get these two leaders up in front. Probably keep Cortina in the back right here where she's at. So maybe I can make a wall um, probably around here somewhere. Alright, let's see what we can do. Uh, they're not going to move. So, yeah, I can't stay back there. They're not going to move. Alright. I'll get this. I'll get this. It won't be long. Make use of the water. Get out of the tight spot in this terrain. I'm kind of glad they're not going to be moving because I don't want to be stuck here in this narrow passage. Being funneled is not fun. It's tight. Yep. Yeah, uh, I'm okay with the formation. It's not terrible. I would like it to be a more, little bit more open, but it's cool. Mm, that's blue against red. Uh, not my ideal setup there. <laughs> I may need to rethink this. Yeah, they're gonna go after her quite a bit. We'll see if I can keep her uh, keep her healthy. I do have a unicorn back there, so it's not too terrible. All right. So you. Cortina, I need you to move here. For sure. This Hydra definitely needs to get that dragon. Start taking him out. Can I get a flyer? Not quite, but I need protection down here. Good hits, good hits, good hits. Oh, uh, Jin. Hmm. Should be worth it to shoot up. Let's shoot up. Perfect. He's level 10. Let's try to keep him healthy. I definitely love an evolved Jin at this point. That's right, he can move and shoot. And hit and run. Man! Those ninjas. If we can take out the Empire, we can we can start recruiting ninjas. Or changing the class ninja. Unlocking that class. That would be fantastic if, that, if I can pull that off. Soon. Sooner rather than later. Uh, I need to finish off this dragon. What level are you, Jin? Four? Let's shoot down this way. Perfect. They shouldn't focus him in the water. Uh, you've got Hellfire, but it's probably best for you to hit a giant. I knew that would happen. Let's go down here, give some batter some room to get up in there. Oh, nice! I didn't think he would do that much damage. Wow, that's... that's good. 
Nice crit, nice crit. Let's bring that guy down. Here it is. Bam. Now I can move the griffin in front of her and keep her safe. There we go. Who are we going to target today? Probably the centaur is best, but he might move out of range. Let's go with the gr the griffin. Let's go with the clay golem. Yeah, that's the right monster. Good, good, good. We have no room for you, as usual. Let's uh, yeah, let's just let's just move on. Unicorn, I need some healing on my lady over here. So now she can make use of Spear Throw, which is great. Fog will definitely help too. Especially on the Rock Bird. Putting Fog on a Rock Bird would be very, very useful. Prevent that stone. Uh, we can shoot up again. What level is this gen? It's five. Yep, let's go up this way. I'm cool with that. These gins are doing their part. Let's give you some protection. You definitely need it since you are in front. This is how you play with your physicals, right here. Uh, just move up one space. I don't care about you right now. Divine Ray of White. That's not worth it, man. Oh, you're going to stay put, huh? Good deal. Stone. Ugh. I almost would have preferred... Did he really just seclude himself all the way down there? Can they get somebody down there? Uh, Griffin, but still. He went up in... <coughs> Excuse me. He went up in the front lines. This is so stupid. Come on, man. This AI is making such bad decisions. I've never seen it this bad, I'm not going to lie to you. Alright, well... <laughs> let's start taking him down, I guess. Hmm. We can make this happen. Hopefully get the kill with Cortina, that would be fantastic. If I can kill him off of her. Can I make it happen? Hydra definitely can't go down that far, but that's okay. Uh, let's get you here. I should be able to do it. If I can pick him off with this ghoul down here, it should be just enough damage for Frost to kill him off. I hope. Let's find out. Here we go. He's gone. Perfect. That was just a little bit over. Dude, you were so stupid. Don't make stupid decisions. Oh, goodness gracious. Alright. I see an ice breath right down the line here. Yep. Up top. Don't put yourself in that position. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Do I see a retreat? Uh-huh. Knew it. Guys, we have another success. That was actually much better than I anticipated. Just because he just threw himself into the fray like that. Uh, Alright. So, I'm going to try to see if I can get some more experience with her. Killing off this dragon. I think we can pull that off. What else do we have here? Clay going... Uh, da, da, da. Still got a gin. I'm gonna pull you back. Just in case they decide to attack with one random monster, which sometimes they will do that. 
Let's give... Uh, you're going to be attacking. Let's give you some protection. Good, good, good. And let's whittle this dragon down for the kill. One more hit, and then the spear throw. I should be good. Spear throw does a little bit less damage than the uh, regular physical attack, of course, so I, would, I, want, I need to be sure about the kill. And this should do it. Sure. Yeah, see, it wouldn't have been enough. So, good thing I did do that. Alright, who are you gonna hit? Who are you gonna hit? Let's hit the centaur. <laughs> I really didn't think it would hit. It's an accurate clay going right there. Uh, who are you gonna heal? Uh, I wish I was in range of that, but that's okay. I can heal that. Griffin instead. Will I be able to take another turn to get that centaur out of the way? I will. What's your HP? Uh, I should definitely be able to kill him with Batterkiss. Yeah, not a problem there. Gosh, we got some amazing experience this time around. This has been great. Very, very produ produ a productive battle. Uh, good, 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 good. This calls for another fight in the same episode. Definitely make use of that time. We're only at 14 minutes. Should definitely have enough time for another battle. And if it lasts too long, you know, I'll cut it in half. Am I going to be able to kill him? Are you for real? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Um, I want to try to kill with the centaur, just because they're so valuable. <laughs> Amazing! Wow. I hate to see him go, he's definitely one of my favorite knights in the entire game, because you can get him if you recruit shootless, which we did not do, but oh well. Guys, that was a great victory! Two wounded knights on the Esgris Empire that will not be participating next turn. Second victory in a row. We still got some more coming up. Oh no! Oh no, this is not good. Uh, we'll be okay. This is fine. It's three against two. Even though they're high level leaders. They're not going to beat us. This will be fine. Plus, they're coming to us, so I can build my wall. I thought it was going to be like Zemeckis, Kador, and uh, Gish or something like that. So, just two. Alright. Don't get cocky. Just stay put. Um, let me see. build this way. Stay in the back. You meet shield, get up in front. You can go here. And you here. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, you can actually stay exactly where you are. And you can do the same. Just waiting it out. He's definitely going to put himself in a position to cast Geno Thunder. I already know it's coming. We don't have any healing. So. Kind of hoping they're going to make a, uh, a really stupid mistake. Oh, sis. Man. I might need to move Melligan's team over here for the t for a while. Just because I need to keep this castle very well defended.
In fact, if I remember correctly, on the map, I should only need one team to keep uh, invading south into Leonia. So, that would actually give me three knights to work with to put whatever, wherever I want. Do that, or do questing. One of the two. Okay, so we need to start hitting hard here. Uh, can we possibly focus the gin here? Hmm. Well, first of all, let's hit him with the rock bird. Nope, nope, nope. Let's do a hit and run. We can't. We can't get up in there. Eh, whatever. That lizard guard is going to get surrounded. Just stay put and attack. Stay put and attack. We've got to concentrate this. Stone, I'm not too worried about it, but... He's gonna die. <laughs> Man, I hope I can last this out. If not, if this is turns out to be a defeat, I'm gonna have to do some serious tactical maneuvers off screen. Anyway. What did he get? Oh, he took a hit from the gen. That's why we gotta get rid of him. Alright, stay there. Should be able to get some experience here for Legel. If she can't do at least 57 damage. Are you kidding me? Wow. That's not cool, man. <laughs> that is not cool at all. Alright, give you some protection. Man. You've got a freaking bow and arrow. You're supposed to be accurate. That Geno Thunder is coming next turn. I already know it. If we can take enough monsters down, they'll retreat just because of numbers. But, I don't know. I really don't know. Starting to get skeptical. <coughs> Excuse me. Let their leader open, but it's probably in our best interest to not snipe the leader and simply go for monster kills. Let's see if we can hit and run. Uh, or hit and run that. That might be better, actually. Take away some healing. Let's try that. Let's go ahead and hit and run this. No! I misclicked. I misclicked. Ah, whatever. I don't care. We're fine. A miss. We're not fine. Hey. Alright, alright. Calm down. This, is, this isn't the end of the world here. Although this is going to hurt. <laughs> That's a lot of blues. I thought Geno Thunder was coming, but... You know, Geno Flame does work well at that part, too. Yep. I knew that was going. Here comes a heal. Ugh, the gin. Nah, whatever. I'm not worried about it. The gin and the wyvern are definitely going down this round. For sure. Mm, she's 
not doing well. Well, no, no. She's being blocked. I won't be able to get to her anyway. Yeah, smart move, smart move. You shoot through your own scorpion? Probably for a kill, right? Yeah. Still. <laughs> it's kind of strange. Oh, you jerk. Hmm. Well, let's see. I'm not going to have enough attack power to kill anything over 100. Not with these fighters. Really? That killed that? Okay, fine. You can actually stay where you are. Alright, so let's get some experience for Lagelle. Hopefully she'll actually hit this time. Uh, Lizard Guard. Lizard Man. Whatever. Don't hit there. Alright. Please hit. Please hit this thing. Thank you. Alright. Good stuff there. Good stuff there. Unicorn's gonna go bye bye this turn. With any luck, that might be enough. We'll see. How far is silence? Let's get some protection on. Does he have any protection right now? Yeah, he's got some... Rockbird. Yep. That's for the best. Okay, I can kill... I can actually kill that human going with Alice's. Um, this griffin... You can move and attack the leader. That might scare him a little bit. Probably not, but... Well, you don't see that every day. Alice is getting a kill. Didn't even level from it, though. Uh, let's see. Let's try to do a hit and run. Good. Protection. No, I never cast that on you. Now's the time. Oy, stressful, stressful. Mm, almost got him. Oh, he didn't do it. This is not good, man. I'm going to lose a lot of stuff out of this one. Yep. Wow. That's bad. This right here is a fight, folks. <laughs> if you've been looking for a little bit more excitement, this is it. Right here. Where I'm getting stressed. Holy word, huh? Okay. Might not be terrible. Might be able to focus the leader in that case. I don't know. They're killing too much stuff. Yeah. I'm gonna lose this. Yep. Dang, man. 
Okay, well, you can't win them all. We gotta get out of here. This is, there's no way I can stay. Not after this. Okay, well, let's see. Uh, let me think here, let me think, let me think. What's our retreating options? God, we got a lot. List noises to the north. Catbury, we've already taken that over. Georgia. Georgia? Really? Oh, right, 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 right. Okay. Um, that's to the bottom. Camel 4 is back. Let's see. To the west. I need one to go to one of these two, and two to go to the other. This noise will be vulnerable, though. Oh, I'll figure it out. So, one to each. Listen noise, Eorgia, and Camel 4 is what's going to have to happen. Okay, you go there. No, don't even bother. Uh, Eorgia. Just because I can. You're going to Camel Ford. Well, there's one of our very few losses that we've experienced, folks. Sorry about the loss, but it happens. I definitely made a mistake of not sending Melligan's team over here to defend this instead. I definitely should have just quested these three and have been done with it. But, you know, you live and you learn. Okay. Anything else going to happen here? We still got battles. Right, that's right, Toria. Oh my goodness. This is going to have to wait. We're already at half an hour. Okay, so let's deploy, save our game, and then close up. We got this. Not a problem. Kato's going to end his turn. Right, right, right. Okay. So, folks, thank you so much for sticking with me through this entire playthrough so far. I'm really having a great time. Despite the loss we just had, it happens. It really does. So, um, especially when you make stupid mistakes like I did. So, anyways, uh, please continue to join me for episode 14 of Brigandy Legend of Force. And I'm having a blast making these things for you guys. So, um, next episode will definitely be a lot more eventful, I'd say. With this battle coming up and maybe uh, some battles invading into Leonia to the south, my main team. So, I'll make some tactical maneuvers off screen tell you the changes that I made and do all that good stuff. So, anywho, thank you for joining me once again. I'll see you next time.